Now, if they're real, if this is a real hero ditto, they're just going to turn base down B and C one. But I don't think they're going to do it. Wait. Wait. Down B. Whack. How hype would it have been if you would have whacked him? Zero to death. Yeah. There's the neutral B that does 39% for no reason. <laughs> Having a big think. There's the F tilt. Paradox going for that hard mm free. Right, right. <laughs> So the thing I don't know about Hero that I want to find out still is since Side B is not a projectile, does Psych Up and Oomph affect it? Because like Psych Up, Side B would be stupid. I don't know if it's a thing. It does? Oh, okay. So what, does Psych Up, Side B just kill at zero? I feel like it has to. Hocus Pocus? Come on. MP? That's still good. That's a still good benefit. There we go. Back air. Frame 18, but it's still, it's got a big hitbox. Nair. Oh, Al Alkirk's got these hero combos on lock. <laughs> All right. I couldn't see if that, oh. Oh. Well, it's new staff to one. Okay, okay. Oh, there's a nice crit. That's all skill. He he planned for the crit. It's one of those things that if you plan for it, it happens. They're both having to think. Surprise, Kaboom didn't suck him in from halfway across the stage. Oh, that's some nice ledge trapping. Alcrick's showing the real counterplay against Hero. If you shield, he can't hurt you. <laughs> I would be more serious, but like, between this character and these two picking him. I'm glad that hit. <laughs> yeah, this is very even. The anti Belmont, you picked Bounce. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't realize. <laughs> what mistake have I just made? That's, yeah. I didn't know that move killed that early. I, I have a hard time watching that land. The jab one mix up on shield, I like it. I like it. Paradox starting to take a little bit of a lead in this high intensity hero ditto. I looked at the chat, something about core fish. I don't really know. I don't really know what gen core fish. Three? That's what I was thinking. That's one of those Pokemon. Woo! That is the one hero move I get hyped for. Hatchet Man? First of all, it's called Hatchet Man. <laughs> like, that's all. <laughs> Just that's sold enough. If Crom had a move called Hatchet Man, I'd just spam it. Like every other move I spam. <laughs> it's best of three, so you can. Uh oh. Oh, you only can ban one. Alright. Yeah, that would be crazy. Now we got Simon Ike. Paired axe off to a good lead. Good call out with the axe. Good call out with the mare. Yeah. Good recovery by Alcrix though to make it back. 
using that aerial drift. And PS2 is wide, so. Yep, the classic holy water down smash. The Krabby Patty with cheese. That's like, I don't know if bread and butter is the word, because that's a combo term, but that's kind of like a Belmont bread and butter. I wish I would have got to see Wednesday's set, because uh, Alkirx was playing really well. Starting to see that a little bit. Good shield grab. Yeah, this is just this is just the rough part against Belmont. I've kind of learned a few tricks on getting off a ledge, but I still am not the greatest. I don't know how that hit, but you know what? Yeah, that that was a snake up tilt. You're exactly right. I would know a thing or two. Good bear. This is still very doable. I mean, we got one nice little string from Alcrix, and this is even. Especially with uh, Belmont's. I don't want to say their disadvantage is terrible, but between down air is like the option. And just as soon as I said that, got some good ledge trapping. Good recovery from Alcrix. I think this is one of uh, Ike's better stages because of the recovery mix up options and the width. Good Nair. <laughs> Playing some neutral. You can't blame Alcrix here. You really... You don't want to commit. The last thing you really can do against the Belmonts is four stuff. Oh, yeah. Interesting uppy, but he didn't get punished for it. Good weaving in and out by Alcrix. Good conversion. He can get a couple more of those. He'd be looking at an evenish game. But Teradex is getting these, uh, these item combos going. He's really intelligent about the whole back. Kind of like the Link Boomerang, the comeback on the Holy Water. He's really good at knowing that's going to hit and doing an option off of that. Good, good F tilt. I feel like F tilt, like, you know, I've seen a lot of good dash attack. I think, you know, a lot of people have been doing move tier lists. I think Belmont F tilt's up there, even though people complain about the projectiles. That F tilt, you space it well, they kind of just have to hold it. Yeah, right there. Hold it. <laughs> good grab. Should get... Oop. Good double grab. That was a great frame trap by Alcrix. Great down air. Yeah, there's that F-tilt again. That move is just... This is suddenly becoming very, very doable for Alcrix. Good dash attack. Let's see if he gets this ledge trap. That's... Great conversion. I don't know if at that percent Nair... Oh, there's the back air. Yep. Suddenly, Alcrix got the lead. That's... I've never really seen a Belmont recover that way or get off ledge that way, but that was really good. I'm going to say I never saw that and, like, Teradax will be like, you know, I did that last set against you. <laughs> Got some neutral. Some good ass neutral. Neither player wants to get hit with the final hit. Yeah, that wasn't gonna take it. Not on Ike's weight. Another good recovery mix up. Yeah. That Nair is just hard to deal with sometimes. Yeah. So... Alkirk's probably banned Kalos, if I had to guess. Going to Battlefield. 
Belmont. Sneaky good stage for the Belmont. I think early meta people just assumed, well, uh, they'll just get comboed for days. But it's really hard to aerial approach a Belmont as it is a good Belmont player. And aerial approaching on battlefield against a good Belmont player is just suffocating. Good up to That back hit of the boomerang coming out. Down tilt off, off of ledge, which is a really good option. Jabs. And something I've kind of noticed is... Erda, or Alcrix's ledge trapping right now has been really on point. It was a big reason. Yeah, that's a good option. Ooh. Just sent it. Attack. That was that was a really smart conversion to just wait on the holy water. Good jump from ledge. Oh, okay. Good spot dodge. Yeah, this is this is get, becoming a significant lead. Uh, he, yeah. I really think he should have got up the grab there, but oh, and that back air. I've always said this is the interesting thing about Ike versus Zoners is Ike lives so long against them. Good nair. Let's see what he gets off of it. That was great frame trapping. This is... Oh, just mistimed it. Yeah, now Crix was being smart there with the patience. That was a great up smash. That hit. That hit. <laughs> Oh my god, I thought he was going to get the triple axe. Another axe. Holy water. Oh, that was an interesting clank. I don't think either player really knew what to do off of that. Cross coming in handy. Let's see what... Uh... Yeah, yeah. And that was really smart to charge down smash instead of have smash. Because that covered the roll. Oh, you... That's awful. I fight with the darkness.